Hi everyone, my name is Abel Gray Kantoma. I'm from Greatest Design Consult. This is my WhatsApp contact. You can reach me on this number. You can call me on any of these numbers, okay? Today I'm going to be showing you how to actually properly interpret your staircase detail, okay? Um, because I've gotten a lot of questions um, about staircase detailing, okay? Um, we have covered structural designs, mechanical and electrical service drawings, road designs, water designs, architectural working drawings, all on our YouTube channel using over 25 different softwares. You can go down below the description of this video. You'll find a link to that channel. Please visit this channel and actually keep yourself busy, okay? Um, so as you can see, we have this staircase here. Uh, Whenever you see this reinforcement here, you can see this is like a in a, a donut, a donut here. But this donut here is telling you that this reinforcement is actually your starter bar, so it's coming from the ground, okay? While this one is actually entering uh, the first floor slab or whatever suspended number of slab that you have there, so this is actually entering that uh, suspended slab there while this one is coming from the ground okay good now you can see this is the staircase while this is actually the cross section of this particular staircase now if you look at this staircase you discover uh, I, this is actually cut from here so we cut our cross section from here <clears throat> so if you are familiar with cross sections um, probably maybe in your technical drawing all that um, this this actually what this means is that <coughs> at it at a a that means we are looking at it from this direction so we are looking to this direction that's from right to left here also we are looking from right to left okay so when we cut this uh, this is definitely what we are going to see this reinforcement which is this is definitely going to be what we have here okay while this reinforcement which is this like i said this is coming from the ground so there's no way we can show it from the plan view that is coming from the ground except in the cross section okay so in the cross section it's showing you this way so in this shape and it will this way you can see this is our o1 which is this if i click on this you can see i have 8y12 o1 at 150 spacing now the size of the reinforcement is gotten and the spacing of the reinforcement are both gotten from the design so you must have done your design so this is just a detailing like i said i just want to show you how to interpret the cross section of your staircase so the design has already been done assuming the size of the reinforcement to be white away from our design and the spacing of our reinforcement is 150 okay so if that is correct, you can see that um, the size of reinforcement here, okay, you can see this is the O1, O2, O3, they are just bar marks, okay, you are just giving them number, like numbering the reinforcement. So wherever you have a different type of reinforcement, you give it a number, okay, or you just give it like a name, okay, that's what it means. So uh, this is our reinforcement one, this is our reinforcement two, this is our reinforcement three. Okay, now this is our reinforcement four. This is the fifth one. This is the sixth one. This is the seventh reinforcement. And this is the eighth reinforcement. So we have eight different type of reinforcement. Okay, not in the sizes. Okay, uh, what we normally put into consideration in giving the reinforcements a different name, uh, the, the sizes could be the reason uh the the uh the length of the reinforcement could also be the reason okay so but in a case where you have a reinforcement spanning in the same span and then having the same size of reinforcement and the same spacing okay so in most cases uh it will most likely uh be the same reinforcement so uh, i'm not going into barbending schedule for you right now okay mm -hmm. so um that will be a class for another day so if that is correct now this reinforcement, uh, <clears throat> which is our O1, this is our O2, 
uh, this reinforcement is what spans from here. So this is the length here now to this place. Like I said, this is the uh, where you are. So this is the first flight. Then you land here. You go another flight. Then before you come to the suspended uh, floor slab. Now, if that is correct, now you see here that we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Then you climb the the thirteenth one, which is here. If you count from here, you know, we discover you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The 13th one is here where you climb to this uh, landing. Okay, you can see it here. Okay, uh, so it's exactly what we have here. So if you try to count from here, you're actually going to get the same thing uh, from here. Let's we are starting from here. So we move this way, we come this way. We start one, two, three, four. Five, uh, six, and then the seventh one, you are here. <clears throat> so uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and then the seventh one here. Now, this is actually your, this reinforcement is entering uh, the suspended floor slab. Okay. All right, good. Now, if that's uh, you see here, I said this is reinforcement one. This is our two, which is this one. And then um, this reinforcement here, if you cut this, you will discover that this reinforcement, uh, which is here, is actually what we are going to have here. You can see it has its return. The same way here, we have a return here. Now, this reinforcement... Uh, is number uh, number three, which is here. So you can see here three O three. Okay. Um, this one, this particular reinforcement, is actually what we have here. These are the reinforcement here. These ones, the ones here. This one, you see them in donuts. Okay. They are the ones here because when you cut that section, this is exactly how you're going to see it. Okay, so this reinforcement here is what we have here, which is O4. So you can see O4, 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 O4. Okay, that is exactly what we are actually having here. So this is our reinforcement O4. Okay, it's actually whitened. Okay, it's a distribution bar. So this is actually uh, the bar. This is also the main bar. We have here our distribution bar here. So this uh, distribution bar, uh, let's look at the callouts here. This display is what we have here, which is this donuts that you see other there. You can see I'm clicking on them and it's shaded. Okay. So these donuts here are our distribution bar. So uh, this bounce from here to here, which here down to this place. So if I click on it, uh, confirm what I'm talking about, you will discover that uh, it is 07. That is the name of this bar, uh, 07. So let me check it here. So I did the calling out by the side. You can see Y10 07 is a top distribution bar. Uh, is a distribution bar 300 okay spacing all right good okay so the same way here you see we have another distribution bar for this this flight here you know this is a different flight this time so for this one which is here uh this and I call it out here, okay. This and it's been called out here, so they are both, uh, okay. 
Y1007. Okay. Y1007. So it's also 07. You can see it continues this way to this place. Out was together. You call this out one. With this one. Okay. Okay, so that is that. Um for those of us who are not familiar with uh, staircase, from this design, our riser is actually uh, 150. Our tread is also 150. Okay. And then the waist is also, sorry, our riser is 150. Our tread is 300. I'm sorry about that. Then our waist is actually 150. The waist is actually here. Okay which is the thickness of the of the staircase itself you know these are just uh the risers best the waist which is the main thickness of the case okay uh i hope you understand what i'm explaining uh staircase is a bit tricky um but uh i just believe uh, some of you must have gotten a little insight from what i have just explained about uh this staircase okay so if you love what you're seeing just like this video by giving it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel it's actually 100 percent free click on the red button and you have subscribed already okay you can leave a comment down below you want to keep following us just go down the description of this video you'll find the link to my youtube channel visit the channel and just enjoy yourself and keep yourself busy okay so uh, make sure you stay safe and make sure you actually stay blessed. Thank you.